when I think of the Aaron Bell, I think of legendary. I mean, it's, I don't know of any other place like it. I've driven past this ranch for years, and you will see, especially when September rolls around and those big bulls start sticking around more, and you will drive past this place in the middle of the day, and those big bulls will be right out in the fields. You just can't compare with it because it's in an over-the-counter, half of it's in, in an over-the-counter unit where you can harvest unit two and Wyoming 124 bulls that migrate into this place because of the feed. My name is Lon Augustin, and we are on the Aaron Bell. I'm in Northwest Colorado, about 45 minutes from Craig, Colorado, and about five miles from the Wyoming border, just outside the town of Bags. The ranch consists of 1,563 acres. There's about two and a half miles of the Little Snake River, and there's about, uh, they, there's over ACFS, the water rights for irrigation. Plus you have a couple of artesian wells that uh, flow into a couple different ponds which they use, that they have industrial rights off that they can sell off. There's multiple springs down along the river. Some, some are developed and more development can even be made out of those springs. The key feature of this ranch is its location as far as hunting units go. It's in an over-the-counter unit on one side of the river and located in hunting unit three. And on the other side of the river is unit two, which is a limited entry draw, known for big bulls and big bucks. It's also five miles from the Wyoming unit 124, also known for trophy quality animals. This morning we watched a group of you know, 15 plus bulls go up over the horizon at daylight. Last night we saw over 100 head of elk coming in from pretty much every direction into the cornfields across the river. I will tell you that very seldom does a ranch come up where you can shoot 360 inch bulls plus in an over the counter unit every year. As far as just the hunting goes, it's incredible, but the income off of ranches are sometimes hard to reach in this area. This place has income off a gravel pit and then on top of that, you have the, the artesian wells that flow into the ponds, um, which they have industrial rights on so they can sell that water off. They are currently getting over 50000 a year just for selling that water out. They were paid not to irrigate some of their fields this year, and they were paid over 300000 for that for this year. It was part of a pilot program that may or may not be available in the future. Just off the feed off this place with the silage and the hay, you're looking at over 300,000 just off of that. And then on top of that, for the hunting, if a guy did want to lease the hunting out, that could bring 100 to 150,000 on top of everything else. So the, the income off this ranch is pretty substantial. You know, this, this ranch has been historically used and in the same family for three, over three decades. And even before that, it was kind of used the same thing. You know, it's been used as part of a, a large livestock operation. So they'd uh, graze fall, summer, and spring on the land, you know, all the, the, the leases around plus the deeded land. And then they'd bring them in here and feed them during the winter time. So the improvements on the ranch, uh, just the pipe fences alone would be over several hundred thousand. They are, I mean, the, the fences, the, the exterior fences, the interior fences, the corrals are, in, I mean, incredible. I mean, I can't even imagine the amount of time and money that went into just the interior pipe fences and the exterior fences on this place. And the shop, it's a huge shop. I mean, there's plenty of equipment storage, a good place to get in and out of the, out of the weather, keep your equipment out inside. If you're interested in the Aaron Bell Ranch, and if you have any questions on this ranch, you can give me a call, Lon Augustin, 970-629-0520, or Lonnie at HaydenOutdoors.com.